to be honest, this is Dean Jackson here. Um, I haven't been vlogging on this channel um, much actually recently because I've been really, really, really concentrating on my Vegan Fresh channel because um, if you don't know, I'm, I've already got I've got a partnership on there now, so I um, I'm really concentrating on trying to build that channel and also I'm doing a raw vegan cleanse which is something that I'm not just doing as a temporary thing I'm doing it as a lifestyle change um so for 30 days I'm going raw vegan I'm vegan anyway but I'm doing raw and I'm doing um going to be going to be going kind of 80% raw after that so I've been really concentrating on that that's the reason why I haven't really been on this channel that much and I've been clearing out my flat and all that stuff and I've got a lot of stuff going on this year so I'm kind of just trying to get everything sorted out and everything I've got a lot of stuff to get done and I've got my book to finish off because uh, my publisher said it needs to get finished by the end of the year so I'm getting that done anyway today I was I, I went out did some work um, I had some work to get done, and so I went out um, and did that, and then I was just walking past a church, and they had like this, um, I don't know how they say it in the States, but it's like a jumble sale, it's like a kind of garage sale thing, but they had like a massive one in the church, um, and you pay like 50 pence to go in, and it's just obviously to raise money for the church, and then um, you can just find loads of really really cool things like obviously they're, or they're like secondhand stuff but you never know what you could find and I wasn't going to go in I went past there twice looking at the place I wasn't going to go in and I went I decided to go in I was like you know what let me just go in anyway I found some really cool stuff I'm going to show you the pièce de résistance actually at the end but you're going to be shocked when I show you anyway I got this weird bag <laughs> I don't normally go for this kind of thing but Generally, I like weird things. Actually, I'm, I generally like weird things. But I, I've never bought a bag like this before. It's got like mirrors on it and all these kind of weird little embellishments. But I got this for fifty pence. Fifty pence. Fifty pence. Come on. Like I thought, you know what? I'm gonna just get it. How much is fifty pence in the US? I have no idea. I've got no idea. I think it might be about eighty pe eighty cents or something like that. Anyway. It's really cool. It's like a velvet bag. And then I got my son some pyjamas. <laughs> I got my son some pyjamas. And these are brand new. They're actually in the packet. Um, where are they from? These, yeah, these are from Marks and Spencers, which is a very good brand in the UK. Um, pyjamas. My son's going to like them. Very, very nice. And then... This is the PS resistance that you're just gonna be like, what? Come on. Some Dr. Martins. Seriously, some Dr. Martins. And guess how much they were? Look, five pounds. So you can see I'm not lying. Five pounds. Five pounds for these Dr. Martins. And they are really, really good, in really, really good condition. The only thing is they've got some scuff marks on them. But other than that, these are amazing, they're in amazing condition and they're the real thing, they're not fake. You know how you get some of these fake Dr. Martins and they just look like Dr. Martins, but they're not. They say Dr. Martins, um, air cushion, the original, um, air walkers, air wear, air wear, with bouncing soles. They're so comfortable, obviously they're comfortable because they're Dr. Martins, but five pounds, five pounds you probably can't get these for cheaper than 90 pounds in the shops and they're five you've got to understand the significance of this five pounds for these i love my dms as well so i was like yeah boy i'm getting them the thing is i didn't rush over to them i saw them i saw them and i was like and the thing is i like white boots like this because years ago when i was younger i had these black and white kind of weird ankle boots. Everyone used to think I was a crazy person. But I think if I wore them now, people would actually think they're quite nice. So yeah, five pounds for these DMs. Like, what? So yeah, I'm so impressed. Uh, yeah, anyway, I saw them and I sort of just slowly gravitated the towards tools them because I could tell they were my size. You know when you could just tell? Because I'm, I'm, I wear like a size three, four, UK size. So I've got little feet and um, I could tell they were my size because they looked cute and small. I was like, oh my God, they're my size. And there was this girl and she was like standing next to me, like looking at them like, oh, how, what's, how, what size are they? 
And I was like, they're my size. And she was like, oh, and she walked off. So I'm like, so stoked right now. Anyway, yeah, and I come across this amazing little store in East London. If you live in East London, I'm not going to tell you exactly where I live, but yeah. If you live in East London, there's this store called Simply Fresh. And it's like a kind of little convenience store, but it's just, it's nice. It's not like some of them nasty convenience stores where they sell really rubbish fruit and veg. It looks kind of like a posh convenience store, but the stuff isn't really expensive. It's still the standard price. They sell fruit and veg. They sell like, it's basically just sell all the like food stuff in there. So it's the sort of place where you can go and you can do your everyday shopping in between where you do your big shop. So I'm going to be going there more often. I'm going to take my trolley down there. I'm just going to buy some bits. So I'm quite happy actually. They sell a lot of organic produce in there. I got, I got a brand called Biona. Is it Biona? Organic coconut oil. Because I love coconut oil because I use it for my skin. Obviously you know that I got, I'm into natural skincare. So I use it for my skin. I use it to make a deodorant. I use it to make a toothpaste. It sounds strange, but yeah. And I also got some Biona organic hemp seed oil which you can use for your skin and you can use it for your hair as well you can also use coconut oil for your nails there's so many different things you can use it for but anyway i've got this hemp seed oil can use to cook you can use to cook of course you can you can use it to put on your um you can use it to put on your um salads that's a salad dressing um the thing is, I've always not liked the taste of, of this for a salad dressing. But I know you can use it for your hair as well, so I'm probably just going to like pour some of this into a little container and use it for my hair and use the rest as a salad dressing or something. They've got some really good quality olive oils in there and stuff. And the one thing I did try today was if you're someone that likes to juice and you're into like fresh organic foods and stuff like that and you want to kind of try out a bottled uh, juice, there's this um, drink, I tried this out called Naked. But you know what? I'm disappointed in it. I'm not going to drink it again and I am not. I don't recommend it. So that's my review on this product it's called Naked Antioxidant, and it's got apple, pineapple, and kiwi kiwi juice. It's apple, pineapple, kiwi juice smoothie. A blend of five juices and purees with botanical extracts. And it contains it contains apple juice, 64% apple juice, pineapple juice, 10%, banana puree, kiwi puree, 8%, mango puree, botanical extracts, powdered spirulina, chlorella, broccoli, spinach, barley grass, wheat grass, Parsley, ginger root, blue, green, alga, algae, and odorless garlic with natural flavourings. And one thing that did actually strike me when I, you know, first actually uh, got this product was um, this product has been gently pasteurised. Um, I drank some of it, but I gave the rest of it away. Um, I'm someone that make my own fresh juices and smoothies at home, but I was out and I'd finished my juice I'd brought with me, so I decided to buy that, and I wasn't very impressed with it, as I said. Gently pasteurise is basically when they heat it up to a certain level to keep it fresh when it cooled down, and to kill off the bacteria. Um, I'm not really a fan of pasteurisation, because it, it basically defeats the object of actually drinking a smoothie because it takes away the nutrients because it's been heated it says gently pasteurized but really that basically means it's been pasteurized so i would not recommend any of these drinks innocent smoothies all them different things they're just completely pointless um you might as well make your own and put it into a bottle or a flask but yeah i got that just to try it out and my verdict of this product is do not buy <laughs> sorry naked but that's just the way it is um I like to be very honest about these kind of things, so yeah, I'm going to do a review of this Biona organic coconut oil, I'm going to do it now actually, so check out that, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, anyway I'm not doing a major, a major, major blog, blog today, as in like doing all the stuff I'm doing when I'm, you know, throughout the day, I'm literally just doing a kind of little update vlog about what I'm doing and also to say that 
I am trying to get myself a smaller camera um, that I can use to take out with me when I go and out and, and I can vlog out because I've got this DSLR camera which I don't really like carrying around to vlog unless I'm going to an event or something like that I don't really like to just walk around holding a camera because I'll be honest with you a lot of people unless you're taking pictures a lot of the time when you go into like supermarkets and stuff like that they kind of look at you funny when you're holding something like that so you know I'd rather have like a I'd rather use my little phone or something like that but the phone I have for some reason once I do the recording the sound isn't there I don't know why um so I'm looking for like a little kind of small camera I can take out I'm probably going to get like the Kodak um I think it's called Z3i or Z3, Z32 or something like that you can use that to like carry you can carry that around and it's HD and stuff so mm, I don't know I might just look into it so um yeah, if I'm not going to be vlog if I'm not vlogging like daily and stuff like that, it's because of that, for that reason. You know, I would rather vlog daily, but because of the fact that I don't have the small camera, like, I don't really want to carry that camera around. And right now I'm just using my webcam. Oh, another annoying thing is my Mac just broke. Like, it's really frustrating because I really enjoyed using iMovie and not my PC. And with my DSLR, it's kind of... A very long-winded process to edit the videos in Windows Movie Maker it just kind of take it works but it takes forever to actually import the folders and stuff and to kind of just doesn't really work out so I'd rather use iMovie for when I use my DSLR but my computer just stopped working it just died on me and so I just basically need to get a new one it's, it's quite an old Mac anyway so it's, it's kind of on its last leg so I'm gonna get a new Mac but as you know Macs are not cheap unless you go for a second hand one which I don't want to do I want to get a brand new one so that's it really, that's my um, two cents. I'm gonna do an um, organic um, oil review. These two products. Fiona! Anyway, see ya! Oh yeah, if you're into um, plant-based health, as in um, you including more fruits and vegetables into your diet and cleansing and stuff like that, Go over to my other channel, Vegan Fresh, because I'm doing this 30-day uh, raw vegan thing. And so I'm kind of vlogging that over there, so you can check that out. And I'm um, also doing, like, recipes and stuff on there. I haven't done recipes for a while because I've been concentrating on this 30-day thing. So if anything, you can check that out if you want. Anyway, peace and love. That's how you do it. Yeah. Bye.